Hey everyone, this is Eric Goldstein with Drone Link, and the goal of this video is to show very quickly how easy it is to create a mission and get a drone in the air. I am going to create a mission this time that has a path, a point of interest, and an orbit. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click on New Plan to start, and then I'm going to select the location where I want the drone to take off, and then I am going to name the mission. I'm going to call it uh, Test plan. I'm going to go with the basic defaults and going to click where I want the drone to, to roughly take off. It's going to set some default um, waypoint locations. I'm going to change the altitude just a little bit. Hit next. Then I'm going to move the initial waypoint locations to where I want them to be. Here and here. Maybe add a few more waypoint locations just to give it a little bit of curve. Now I want to set a point of interest. So I am going to right click where I want the point of interest to be. How about in this circle right above me? I'm going to click new point of interest in marker. And then I'm going to let this stay the way it's going to be. Then I can move the marker where I want that point of interest to kick in. I'll do it over toward the beginning of the mission. Done. That's all ready to go. Now I want to create an orbit. So again, I'm going to right click. I'm going to do a new component and then I'm going to select orbit and it's going to drop an orbit in. Uh, not exactly where I want it, so I'm going to clear this out of the way. Define, make sure the path, actually, first I'll make sure the path and the radius is set um, correctly, at least roughly. Then I'm going to drag the orbit over to where I want it to be, which will be right in this center here. I'm going to move the, the radius so it encompasses this entire location and done. So at this point I want to preview the mission. I'm going to click on the mission preview button and it's going to quickly create a mission for me. Now before I actually play the mission let me take a quick look at the statistics and make sure everything looks the way they want it to be. I can scroll down here look at the altitude, look at the horizontal speed, the vertical speed, and the distance from me. That all looks good. So I'm going to hit play and I'm going to speed things up so I can move this thing along a little bit faster. And you'll see that in my upper right hand screen, I can actually make this full screen if I wanted to, but it'll show the drone flying along here. Now I can pause this if I want and then just drag this marker along and actually do it myself so I can kind of see to make sure that that looks right. That's the path I want it to follow. Now let's let go of this thing, hit play again, go to four times speed, and move over to my orbit. Again, the orbit looks pretty good. I think we're centered where we want to be and the altitude that we want to be. Okay, I'm going to speed this to the end, and then I'm going to zip over to my, uh, my iPad. Okay, I'm going to switch over to my iPad and I'm going to run the native app. I'm already logged in. I'm going to see the test plan that I created. I'm going to load it. Now, I'm going to take off from this location and move away from some of these trees. I don't want to go straight up and clipping a tree, but I'm going to move out over the water a little bit. And then I'm going to click, press play. It's going to count down. Three, two, one. And then boom, it's going to take off. And I've got this sped up a little bit in the interest of time but you will see that it, it, it rises to the altitude that we want, and then it will start the mission here. Now I've sped this up four times to make this video a little bit shorter, but you'll see that it flies over along the path. It starts pointing at a point of interest. The result, and this is also from a screen grab off my iPad, not the resulting image, so it's not going to be as clear, but uh, after it's done doing the point of interest, it's going to fly over to our orbit and start doing, it's going to, going to look toward the center of the, uh, the circle. And uh, just to kind of show you here quickly, I switched over. Here's a quick view of the mission preview again, so you can kind of see the mission preview versus the resulting screen grab from the drone flight. And then I'll switch back again to the screen grab. And that's it, guys. So again, in two minutes, I created a mission, put the drone down, hit play, and I've got a mission with a point of interest, a path, and a, uh, an orbit. Hope that helps. Any other questions, let us know.